Good morning, Atlanta Coast High School. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance and remain standing for a moment of silence. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. Thank you. Please be seated. It's Monday, December 18th, and welcome to the Morning Rays. Congratulations to our varsity boys basketball team, which defeated Mandarin this past Friday night, 87-68. to It's the fourth win in a row for the Rays of Trey. Their next game is this Wednesday against Lee. It's a home game. The JV game begins at 5.30 and varsity at 7.00. A couple weekends ago, the Atlantic Coast Varsity Brain Brawl team finished with a record of seven wins and one loss in a tournament. Some of our seven wins came against the likes of Bowles, Bishop Kenny, and Paxson. The team members are listed on your screen, and this group will have the number three seed in their next round of play. Congratulations to the Brain Brawl team. A reminder that if you would like to compete in a spoken word competition called Louder Than a Bomb, the interest meeting is today at 2.15 in Mr. Norris's room, 321. Rays of Hope members, there's an important meeting today after school in room 522. Please make every effort to attend. And finally, the next few weeks in Jacksonville should be exciting because for the first time in 10 years, the Jaguars will be in the playoffs. To put things in perspective, this year's senior class was in second grade the last time the Jaguars were in the playoffs. Here's a few more facts to end the announcements with, courtesy of the Jaguars' Twitter account. Ten years ago, Netflix still used envelopes. The hottest song was Crank That by Soldier Boy. The first version of the iPhone had just made its debut a few months earlier. The top movie was Pirates of the Caribbean at World's End. Miley Cyrus was still Hannah Montana. Taylor Swift was still country. And Blake Bortles was a freshman in high school. Those are all of the announcements for today. Students, good luck on your exams and finish this semester strong.